Lord also did have that uh, one spill over on the southeast side of town where it'd be great if Valdosta would mention which waterway it goes into. It actually went into a bay um, on that one, and we had to report it, I believe, as 25,000 gallons, but the video was on my phone. It was sent to me, and it was not 500 gallons, but we err on the side of caution now, and we err on the side of what flowed past that area. But you'll see that it was just coming up through the four holes of the manhole cover and was very minor. Um, that, that's still no excuse. 500 is 500 too many. It truly is. But the, the, we reported that one was a 25,000 gallon spill. Well, all the people whose lawns and uh, driveways it was flowing over didn't consider it minor. No. Well, I went down there and looked, and by the way, the drainage ditch, ditch definitely runs to the east to Knight's Creek, which is not how it was reported. Oh, I thought it was the bay. Sorry about that. Which is actually kind of odd because every time it's spilled there before, which it has, it's been reported as Knight's Creek. And Knight's Creek goes into Grand Bay eventually, and then into Galapagucci, and then into Philippa. So that well, one could not have affected the Wipicucci. Thank you for that information, but also go down there now and you'll see we're rectifying with that so it, it never happens again. That's that. Are we going to fix the potholes in the middle of the road? Yeah. We sure will. When it's all said and done, we got some work to do down there, and and obviously elevation because it the whole manhole went under. Yeah, there was so much water there; it all went, it got submerged. Okay, so you know this is an example. Yes, congratulations, Valdosta, on doing better. But we're watching. Yep, and and John.